Hello, my creative friend. For the sake of your career, you need to, if you're not already doing it, you need to start learning how to listen to your body. I was on a call last night with one of my very best friends in the whole world who is on disability right now. And towards the end of the conversation, you could just see and hear his mind was just shutting down. Like his brain was like, I'm out, I'm done for the day. You know, which was fucking so aggravating for him. Um, and then for me to watch it and be like, there's nothing I can do here. Um, so when I get on here and start talking about fucking grinding and pushing and don't quit and all that kind of shit, I mean it, but you have to mean it in the context of your body. Uh, because your body doesn't give a fuck what you think. It really doesn't. I'm up here, I'm fucking hiking, you know, I'm eating my veggies, I have apps that track my veggie intake, doing all that shit, right? And still, my body could be like, you know what, today, aneurysm, like, and there's nothing you can fucking do about that shit. You can eat all the veggies you want to. It's, it could still happen, right? So, yes, you need to push, you need to grind, you need to hustle, blah, 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 whatever the fuck but you have to do it in the context of your body and you have to learn to hear what your body is telling you because we can, I think our body has, has tones just like we do when we're talking to people, right? And if you're thinking in your head, okay, I gotta write that book today, I gotta paint that picture, I gotta do that thing, whatever, and your body's like, nope, not today, then you need to be able to hear that and be like, okay, today is not gonna happen and I need to rest, right? But then there's other times when you're sitting there and you're trying to get ready to go and, and do your thing and your body's like, ooh, I'm, I'm real sick. <laughs> I can't do anything today. I should, I should watch Netflix. Bullshit. Nope, you're, you're phoning it in. I don't believe you. That's the difference you need to fucking be able to, to distinguish between, you know? Those are two very different types of tone of voice, so to speak. Uh, anyway. Um, yeah, I just want you to know that when I get on here and I talk about, you know, don't quit and pursue your dreams, all that kind of good stuff, which I 100% believe, I always mean it in the context of taking care of yourself first, because this is it. This is the, <laughs> this like an actor, this is the tool you were given to use and you need to take care of it as best you can. And sometimes that tool is going to be like, fuck you, I'm out. And there's nothing you can do about it. And that sucks. Do what you can safely and as healthfully as possible. Um, your body is 100% your first uh, tool, again, tool, uh, when it comes to your creative career or your creative endeavors. So you have to take care of it as best you can. And when it says, screw you, I'm out, okay, then you pick up the pieces and do what you can safely, okay? If you're not, if today's one of those days, man, I'm really sorry. Get some rest, chicken soup, whatever, <laughs> whatever it is you got to do. Uh, drink lots of water, you know, try to get up off the couch if you can, go for a walk if you can. And if that's just not that day, okay, it's cool. Um, write some ideas down, do something, you know. Um, if on the other hand, today's one of those days where we're like, oh, I don't really, I'm so tired and sick. Bullshit, you got to call bullshit on that and get up and do the work, right? Anyway, hope that helps. Take care.